Hi students. Okay, today we are learning the topic is double integral in polar coordinates. In the previous lecture, we uh, discussed the topic is double integral in Cartesian coordinate. That is x comma y. So now we are polar coordinates. That means integration in r comma theta. Okay, na. So that is equal to here. See the definition is let f of r comma theta be a function in polar coordinates r comma theta then double integral of f of r comma theta over the region r is denoted by integration over r f of r comma theta dr dt is equal to integration theta is equal to theta 1 to theta 2 integration r is equal to f1 of theta 2 f2 of theta f of r comma theta dr d theta that means integrating with respect to r and theta so all limits may be constants or function of theta and theta limits is always constant because theta is an angle so theta is always an uh, constants uh, and r limits are function of theta or constants so this is a double integral in polar coordinates see the example here So evaluate integration 0 to 5 by 2, integration 0 to 1 or sin theta dr d theta. So observing here, so integration 0 to 1 and that is the R limits. R limit 0 to 1 and theta limit 0 to 5 by 2. The function is R into sin theta. So that is equal to so integration is also separating because r limits theta limits both are constants and function r and function theta that is also separating so that is equal to integration is also separating that is equal to so that is equal to integration theta is equal to 0 to 5 by 2 sin theta d theta into integration of or is equal to 0 to 1 or dr so that is equal to integration of sin d theta minus cos theta so that is equal to substituting the limits 0 to 5 by 2 and integration of r r square by 2 r limit 0 to 1 so that is equal to simplification is uh, cos 90 0 minus of minus plus cos 0 1 r is equal to 1 1 by 2 minus 0 that is equal to 1 by 2 so that is the required value of the given integration so this is also short question very very important question in the examination maybe will come so okay so see the next example So evaluate integration 0 to 5, integration 0 to a sin theta or dr d theta. So that is equal to here, observing the limits, first integrating with respect to r because r limits are a function of theta, r is equal to 0 to r is equal to a sin theta and the theta limits 0 to 5 so that is equal to now first to integrating with respect to r gada. integration of r r square by 2 so r is equal to 0 to a sin theta substituting so first of all substituting upper limit so 1 by 2 is the common constant integration 0 to pi that is equal to a square sin square theta minus 0 into d theta that is equal to here a square by 2 into integration 0 to pi so sin square theta is equal to can be right 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 into dt so that is equal to a square by 4 1 by 2 common a square by 4 so integration of 1 theta minus 
इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ कॉस टू टीटा साइन टू टीटा बाई टू और सब्सटूटिंग अपर लिमिट फाइव लोअर लिमिट जीरो सो ए स्क्वेयर बाई फोर फाइव माइनस जीरो माइनस जीरो प्लस जीरो दैट इज इक्वल टू फाइव ए स्क्वेयर बाई फोर दिस इज अ रिक्वाइड वैल्यू ऑफ द गिवन इंटीग्रेशन ओके इज अ क्लियर so this is a in double integral in polar coordinates okay so thank you for more videos please do subscribe my channel like and share it thank you